So it's um, December 29th in Stonington, uh, Connecticut, and I'm over here checking out the Dog Watch Cafe for dinner with a good buddy of mine, Michael Rabinowitz, and his wife, Merrily. Let's see what they have. So it's a nice sized restaurant. It's got a lot of seating here. We're going into the main room here. They gave us a nice little restaurant seat, but uh, we got a nice bar area and a nice dining room area. And they're busy and noisy, and we're going to have a great meal. I'm a dog watch up here in uh, Stonington, Connecticut, and I'm getting ready to try the amazing Booyah base and a couple of maybe appetizers. We'll see what happens, and I'll let you know. Um, what is dog watch? Dog watch is uh, the watch, the late watch, on, on, on a ship. It's from midnight to, I think, six in the... Uh, What's your name? I'm Dave. Dave? Dave. And are you the owner here? I'm one of the owners. There's three of us who want it. My beautiful wife, Wendy, who okay. you already met. That's right. And then my partner, Clay, and myself. So how long have you been here? We opened May 19th, 2008, and we'd never run a restaurant before. Oh, God. It was quite an experience, to say the least. And what gave you the idea for the name Dog Watch? <laughs> <laughs> we had a naming party. Yeah. Okay. And so we had all our friends over when we were renovating the restaurant. And it was very cool because we couldn't think of a name. So we had a facilitator. A friend of ours is a facilitator. And we had paper all over the place. And we came up with 500 names, none of which we liked. And finally we left the, we left we left that and a friend of ours called us up and said, you know, there's a term called the dog watch on a ship and we're all sailors. And the minute my partner and I heard it, that was it. We said that's perfect. And everyone thought we were crazy when we did this. Because they were gonna call it the dog walk, the dog poop, the dog whatever. <laughs> and then we had an artist do the dog. Oh yeah. I don't know if you can okay. see the dog very yeah, well. I can see it. The dog, the dog and and the rest is history. So what's the specialty of the house? We make two things that are legendary that I will challenge anyone in America okay we Bobby Flay where are you uh, the first is our bula base which is a chef special recipe it's absolutely fantastic the other the next one is the seared tuna if you're a seared tuna fan now the interesting is very rarely do seared tuna people and bula base people mix okay? yeah I have some people that come in and eat bula base three or four nights a week and they'll never try the seared tuna that's how they are and the same with the seared tuna but but the fish is fresh every day. Uh, you know, great salads, great burgers. It's a very casual place. You well, can we're come right give, off your boat. You we're going to give it a good shot tonight. <laughs> cool. So we're going to eat everything. Everything. What's, what's your favorite food? My favorite food? My next meal. <laughs> Oh, sequin dog. Okay, right. so Vicki, tell yes. us a little bit about this wonderful place. Let's see. You know, it's a fantastic restaurant on the water. Can't beat the view. But besides that, I've been doing this for 17 years. It is the best restaurant I have ever worked in. I'm not, I'm not exaggerating. I'm not What's exaggerating. your favorite meal? You know, it varies. I go from the open-faced steak sandwich, which is absolutely delicious, uh, to the seared tuna. Fantastic. What about that bouillon base I was warned about? Booyah base is really good. That is chef's specialty. People have followed him around for that booyah base. Can't, can't be beat. So, really, what's your favorite meal here? When I come for lunch, it's tuna nissoir. Absolutely amazing. And how many times have you been here already? Oh, seven, eight. Really? So this is one of your favorite places. Definitely. That's cool. When you go out, they have tables outside when it's warm. It's so beautiful. And it's right there on the water. The water, yeah. Cool. Yeah. Well, let's check out our so meal. Wendy, how long have you been here? Uh, Dave and I opened the restaurant with my brother Clay. It's almost been five years. May of 08. That's good. And yes. you've got quite a crowd here. Me too. What's yes. what's uh, what's your favorite dish? My favorite dish is the seared tuna. It is, huh? I probably have the seared tuna three days a week. Damn, and I was thinking of the bouillon base, and now I'm being turned. Well, my brother's favorite is the bouillon base. Yeah, yeah, but everybody's talking about the seared tuna. You'll, you can't go wrong either way. I'm usually a sushi guy, and so... The scallops are also outstanding. Oh, That's really? So would they make me like a seared tuna with a couple of scallops on it? Okay, whatever you like. I Our would like that. Very flexible. I would like a little wild rice on the side. Um, I, we can check and see. No problem. I'm in. Yeah, <laughs> sure. You just let your server know and they'll be happy to help you. Good for you. Okay, thank you. Okay, enjoy. Fragiabo, Fragiabo's good.
Wanna do that? Yeah, we'll we'll do it we'll do a family style. Yeah, right, let's so see. We just divided in thirds for you. Here we go. All right. So what is this? This is the base. Ooh, that looks oh so good. I know you're gonna, you're gonna be in heaven. This is gonna be a three-hour meal. So you're gonna eat the crust first, huh? How is that? Oh, oh man. Yeah. This is really good, Harvey. Oh, okay, Michael. Michael, what do you think? Out of this world, Harvey. Yeah. Fantastic. Oh. All right, so what do we got? The seared tuna. Made of honor's Ooh, seared tuna. Like, so these are the uh, broiled scallops and mashed potatoes. Family style. You guys have got a little nibbling here. Of yeah, everything, this right? is cool. Yeah. The size of those scallops. Look at this. Man, these are yeah. really good. Yeah, check Wait it out, Michael. Hot. Hot. But tasty, huh? Whoa. Now what do you so got? tender. All right. It's really tender. The seared tuna going in there. Whoa. No, no good. We have to, we have to send it back. Wow. <laughs> try these uh, seared scallops first. How are they, Harp? Just like my mother wished you could make. Let me try this wonderful seared tuna. Oh. It's a dirty job I have. Oh my god, this is so good. This place is number one. You gotta visit it. Dog watch. Who oh, no. Jim, and you're the chef here? Yes, I am. Okay, and uh, everything we had today was just amazing. That bullion base was just amazing. How do you make that thing? Uh, we've been making it for about 15 years. So. That's that's your own signature recipe there. Yeah, well, we developed it between the harbor side before we came in, I came in here. So. And it's more French than Spanish. I can tell by the yeah. spicing there. Yeah. It's very good. And the ahi tuna? That's uh, something that we just played with here and just kept going working it with. What, when you go out to eat, what's your favorite meal? <laughs> <laughs> when I get out of here, I don't. <laughs> we don't really go out. I know. I have a lot of chef friends, and they say, yeah. "Just make me peanut butter and jelly." Yeah, right. I'm, a, <laughs> I'm either you know tater tots and uh, you know gravy and turkey or whatever. You well, know. what you you should have a favorite. No, actually, I mean I like to go to a good steak. I got a buddy that works at the casino and. What is your favorite dessert here? Well, I mean, listen, it has to be the Wendy pie because Wendy makes it. <laughs> but you don't have to say that. Is that no, your favorite? No, it actually is really good. She did. I like that too. But you know what? My second would have to be the brownie rock slide. Is that what they got over there? Yes. Did you see that over there? I saw that over there. It was it was, pre it was pretty alluring, wasn't it? Yeah, multi orgasmic. So that's the mud pie. This is the brownie. Whoa! Look at that. How are we sharing this? And what's that? And this is the Wendy pie. Oh my god, we got three of these I things. We only ordered two. No, it's okay, we got three. <laughs> yeah, what is that? Oh, that's the brownie delay, right? Yeah, All right, let's see. What is that like? Look at that. Look at that face. Oh my, oh my god. god. Uh, but you're going to say that for everything, I'll bet. No. No? This is really good. All right, we're going to try the Wendy pie. Okay, I'm going to get, I'll, I'll, I'll get into that thing. Yeah, that looks good, huh? Mm. Oh my god, there goes my boy. Oh, we can't do you. got into the wrong arms here. Uh, uh, Sex. <laughs> the wet spot is in your mouth. <laughs> oh my oh, god! It's that was bad. That's over the top. Pie going in. Mm. Going down. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. Here I am, Stonington, Connecticut, going down on the mud pie. Oh my god! Can you see that? Yeah. yeah. All right. So it's got chocolate ice cream, vanilla ice cream. It's got coconut. It's got all sorts of stuff. It's got a million calories. Mmm. Mmm. Oh. oh my god. It's good to be me. <laughs> On a scale of 1 to 10, where, where does this ten. dog watch Absolutely. come in? Oh, 10. No question. Definitely a 10, huh? <laughs> I think it's an 11. An 11? I think it's an 11. You think it's an 11? I think it's an 11. Okay. Every, every time we come here, it's perfect. There's never anything wrong with it. 
So this is my first time here at the Dog Watch, and uh, I'm never coming back again. I, I just, I gotta, I don't know. This, this is amazing. <laughs> mm. They're going to find me dead, foaming at the mouth with Wendy's pie. Did you try it, Harold? Oh, yeah. Tried the pie. Everything was just definitely a 10. Stonington, Connecticut. What a Who knew? West Jabum place this is to have such a wonderful restaurant here. This is the place to go. And when you come, make sure you haven't eaten for two days.